it's it's a stupid home so there's there's no wi-fi there's no bluetooth so everything's like it's it's hardwired metal shielded ethernet cable that's through the whole house because i don't like to have like wi-fi signals bouncing around i just really i, I don't feel good I don't See, f- yeah i've always wondered about yeah. that like yeah. what what is that doing to us well, apparently, I, I just I actually just read. There's a there's a really good new book that came out. It's called like the the non tinfoil hat guide to EMF. I think is, is the full title mm. of the book, but it goes into this idea of what are called voltage gated calcium channels on your cell membrane, and how those actually get affected by Wi-Fi. And apparently, you see like a like a change in the electrochemical balance across the actual membrane in response to things like Wi-Fi. Uh, apparently, Bluetooth affects red blood cells, and oh. I haven't seen a, I haven't seen a lot of like actual you know in vivo research on that. But I know that I feel better when I don't have like the Wi-Fi router going, or you know I I turn off all my all everything at night. There's kill switches in all the bedrooms, so it's ba- you walk into the house and it's just super clean. You know everything's HEPA air filters, negative ion generators, no Wi-Fi, no Bluetooth. 